I said, well, look, I'm not sure why they're calling me in. And I said to my mother, I said, well, well come and join me. Went down and everybody had been asked to come in. Pierce Brosnan is a well-known Irish actor, film producer, business person, activist, artist, visual artist, and environmentalist. This man is probably best known for being the fifth actor to play secret agent James Bond in the Bond movie series. Let me tell you that he starred in four Bond films, including GoldenEye, Tomorrow Never Dies, The World Is Not Enough, and Die Another Day. Moreover, Pierce has portrayed this character in several video games, he was nominated for a Saturn Award for his role in GoldenEye. Moreover, the actor was nominated for a Golden Globe Award in 1982 for his role in Nancy Aston. Then in 2005, he received his second Golden Globe Award nomination for his role in The Matador. Bond. James Bond. Yes. I mean, he is the, he is the crown and the jewel of it all. Mm, if there's... Uh, if you enjoy these videos, please remember to hit the like button as it does help us out a lot. And comment below who your favorite celebrity is that you'd love to see in an upcoming video. His full name is Pierce Brosnan OBE, but he's also known as Irish. He was born May 16, 1953 in Drogheda County, Louth, Ireland, making him 67 at the time of this production. He stands 6 feet 2 inches tall or 1.88 meters. The actor is known for his charitable work as well as environmental activism. Back in the year 2020, he was ranked number 15 on the list of greatest Irish film actors by the Irish Times, and in 1997, the actor received his star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame at 7021 Hollywood Boulevard. Pierce was made an honorary officer of the Order of the British Empire in 2003 by Queen Elizabeth II. However, he was not able to receive a full knighthood since he's an Irish citizen. He received an honorary degree from the Dublin Institute of Technology in 2002. The next year, he received another honorary degree from the University of College Cork. Pierce became an American citizen while still retaining his Irish citizenship in September 2004. The actor said, My Irishness is in everything I do. It's the spirit of who I am. As a man, an actor, a father, it's where I come from. Since the year 2001, this man has been an ambassador for UNICEF Ireland. From 1997 to 2000, he worked with the International Fund for Animal Welfare and the Natural Resources Defense Council to stop a proposed salt factory from being built at Laguna San Ignacio. The actor has been married twice, has five children as well as three grandchildren. Pierce met an Australian actress named Cassandra Harris through her stepson named David Harris when Pierce met Cassandra, he said, What a beautiful-looking woman. I never for an instant thought she was someone I'd spend 17 years of my life with. I didn't think of wooing her or attempting to woo her. I just wanted to enjoy her beauty and who she was. The pair started dating and got married in December 1980. Together, they had a son named Sean who was born September 30, 1983. After the biological father of Cassandra's two children, Charlotte and Chris, died, Pierce adopted them. In 1987, Cassandra became seriously ill and was diagnosed with ovarian cancer. She died in December 1991. At that time, Cassandra was 43 years old. Pierce met an American journalist named Keeley Shea Smith in 1994. They got married in 2001 and have two sons together, including Paris and Dylan. Which I enjoy very much. The heat is pretty intense. We shot in the height of summer, the first season. Second season, I said, we have to go in the fall. He was born to Mary and a carpenter named Thomas Brosnan. The name of his grandfather was also Pierce Brosnan. He lived in Navan in County Meath for 12 years and attended St. Anne's Primary School. Thomas abandoned the family while Pierce was still an infant. At the age of four, his mom moved to London where she worked as a nurse. On the other hand, Pierce was brought up by his maternal grandparents. After his maternal grandparents, Philip and Kathleen Smith, died, the actor went to live with his aunt and then his uncle. Pierce was later sent to live in a boarding house which was run by Eileen. Pierce once said about his childhood, Childhood was fairly solitary. I never knew my father. He left when I was an infant. To be Irish Catholic in the 1950s and have a marriage which was not there, a father who was not there, the mother, the wife suffered greatly. My mother was very courageous. 
she took the bold steps to go away and be a nurse in England, basically wanting a better life for her and myself. My mother came home once a year, twice a year. Pierce also attended Ark Putney Academy and decided to become a painter after leaving school at 16. The actor attended St. Martin's School of Art and trained for three years as an actor at the Drama Center London. He then started working as an acting store stage manager at the York Theater Royal. Pierce made his acting debut in Wait Until Dark and later played the role of McCabe in the British premiere of the Red Devil Battery Sign. The actor made brief appearances in films like The Long Good Friday and The Mirror Cart. Pierce became a TV star in the U.S. with his role in Mansions of America. He moved to Southern California in 1982 and starred an NBC series called Remington Steel. Pierce went on to play the lead role in several successful films such as The Fourth Protocol, The Deceivers, Noble House, The Lawnmower Man, and Nightwatch. Pierce then gained success with the Bond film series. In March 2021, he appeared as Dr. Fate slash Kent Nelson in the film called Black Adam. I live there. It's been my home for 35 years. If I'm going to show the work, that seems like a, a good place to do it. It's a collection. Pierce has primarily accumulated his net worth from acting. In 1995, he earned $16.5 million from the film titled Die Another Day. Then in 1997, he earned $12.4 million from The World Is Not Enough. His salary for appearing in Tomorrow Never Dies was $8.2 million in 1999. Then in 2002, the famous actor earned $4 million for appearing in GoldenEye. He also makes money from his Los Angeles-based production company called Irish Dreamtime, which he co-founded with an American film producer named Beau St. Clair back in 1996. The total net worth of Pierce Brosnan is $200 million. Pierce, along with his wife Keeley, owns several impressive properties across the globe. Back in 1996, he purchased a house in Malibu out of foreclosure for $600,000. He then sold this property in 2012 for $2.6 million. In 2000, Pierce and Keeley purchased a beachfront property in Malibu for an undisclosed price. The property covers one acre. The couple later acquired the next door property. Let me tell you, they spent around $7.4 million acquiring land. The pair went on to tear down the existing structures and built a Tahitian-style mansion. The mansion covers 13,000 square feet and sits on 120 feet of ocean frontage on Broad Beach of Malibu. Last year, the couple listed this property for $100 million. In 2019, they bought a house in Santa Monica, California for $2.4 million. They also own a multi-home compound on the Hawaiian island of Kauai near Anini Beach. Pierce Brosnan owns the following cars, a Ford F-150, an Aston Martin V12 Vanquish, a Range Rover Vogue HSE, a BMW 750i, a BMW i8, a Ford Anglia, a BMW H7 Hydrogen.
a Mercedes-Benz CL65. 